These past couple weeks of weather have been quite a uh, quite a year, huh? It's we've been looking at rainfall totals double digits, snowfall totals now triple digits, numbers that we just typically do not see around here. It's wrapping up after today, but we're not completely done. Along the 10 uh, through Pomona, we are seeing a heavier shower move from northwest to southeast. So Chino Hills, heads up for that. It's going to pour for a couple minutes. We see rain leaving Orange County, still snowing up in the San Bernardinos around Big Bear. Triple digit snowfall over the past seven days. And the grapevine. Uh, in the mountains, we see a lag time. Front's gone, but showers continue because of that elevation rise. The moisture banks up against it, rings it out like a washcloth up at the, our mountain peaks and our passes. So the grapevine could be an issue uh, through the afternoon. We may have that road shut down for a while. You saw Tina's report a couple minutes ago. It's not very nice up there right now. Santa Monica, 52 degrees. It's windy. We have wind gusts at 22 miles per hour. Today's high, a whopping 52, 53. Maybe you make it up to 56 if you're lucky in Los Angeles. Santa Ana, 54. Ontario, 48 degrees. 21 degrees colder than average. This continues our streak. We are now in record territory. Any time of year, any year, you have to go back to 1989, the last time that we had a streak of not hitting even 60 degrees in Los Angeles. That was 34 years ago. We're not going to do it tomorrow. The streak will end today at 8, but it is the longest streak we've had in a generation where we've been this cold for this long. Let's look forward to the weekend and a different weather pattern. Saturday, sunshine, 63. Sunday, partly sunny, slight chance of a shower, 60 degrees. We still have some unstable air over our higher elevations. Please watch out for that. Even some snow possible in the Antelope Valley this afternoon. But Futurecast does paint a drier picture, not completely dry, but drier. Even the snow leaves the mountains by this evening. And then as we move forward, there are no more big storms heading in our direction. We are dry on Thursday, dry and sunny on Friday. Saturday looks mainly sunny, and the latest computer models keep most of a weaker storm to our north on Sunday. So it's an increasing chance that we will be completely dry from this evening through the middle of next week. We need that much time to let the soil dry out. We might get it. 61 degrees tomorrow in the metro, 64 on Friday. Still cooler than average, but better. We're seeing things clear out for the valleys. Your warmest day will be Friday's 65. In the Inland Empire, watch out for some snow and rain wrapping up soon. 62 degrees by Friday. High desert, you may get some snow this afternoon. You're getting sunshine tomorrow, Friday, and through the weekend. And our beaches will be back close to 60 degrees, but still kind of breezy this afternoon, even into tomorrow, but with sunshine. That's your forecast.